How's it going everyone? We are back at it with some more Sword Online Memory Defrag and unfortunately it's hard to say this but the servers are shutting down August 30th we got about roughly two more months of this game being here so enjoy it while it lasts um of course we gotta be making laves because they're not going out without a bang so if we go into the news real quick before we are gonna be summoning by the way so if we go into the news um here we got the letter saying uh that they're shutting down the servers um august 30th at 15 jst time um so you cannot purchase memory D diamonds no more and um yeah guys enjoy the game while it lasts um like i said um they're not going out without bang they have a lot of stuff scheduled out they got this new banner which is probably gonna be the last banner um or at least last banners um they released like two or three banners so we we're gonna get uh some nostalgic memories i'm guessing it's like a story event we're gonna get an underworld um eat ranking events some boss battle rushes um let's say it's Minecraft 100 floor ruby palace uh, another ranking event uh, there's multi events uh scouts uh, they're gonna really celebrate scene on the birthday um and uh, tons of things coming uh to give some of the new characters that um basically i released so i know that that kirito and also have a banner this also has a banner i believe this leaf as well has a banner this is going to probably be the scene that they're talking about that's going to be coming out very soon as well as this Yu-Gi-Oh! and Alice. And that's not all. Um, Even though they are shutting down the servers on August 30th, they will be releasing a new version of Memory Defrag that you can play offline. Um, So on August 30th, when uh, at 6 UTC time, um, so I believe that's like a couple hours after um, the game shuts down, the, you can still play the offline version. Um, you just need to go to the app store download it and in there it says that you can get character illustrations quests and playbacks of stories so i'm guessing some events that they're gonna leave release as well as they're gonna be putting 60 characters that have been already pre-selected for the offline version um so the information available they're gonna release illustrations and voices the equipment um, can, that you have gotten i believe uh sword and battle skills profiles ability and skill slots um and so much more um but you know you, you guys can look at it at your own time but here we're gonna be summoning i guess on the new banner so let's get this out of the way first um oh we got the uh but yeah, tell me guys, what do you guys think of this? Um, I was honestly shocked when I first heard this. I thought it was just a troll. Um, so I started looking deeper. I looked into in game news and everything, and yeah, it was it was real. Um, uh, this game holds a lot of good memories for me. Uh, cause I remember when I started playing this game, it was like, I believe it was like one year that the game had already been released. Um, it was during like the one year anniversary or something like that when I actually started playing this game on, I was in high school and uh, me and my friends would play this game all the time and you know it was a lot of good good times and uh, eventually you know I stopped playing and then when I started YouTube you know I, I was like you know what let's let's make some content on this game too this game was fun hopefully we can get back in it and uh, you know we barely recently got him playing back and now they're shutting down servers so um so yeah i'm i'm sad shocked and uh you know it's true what they say everything that has a beginning hasn't has a means of an end so even though this is the end of memory defrag we gotta look at the bright side um this opens up the door for new oh, let's get this this opens up the door for a lot of new things in the future such as um maybe uh let's do one more here Maybe they're um, they're shutting down. You know they're shutting down game. They're probably gonna be working on the Rex, the Rex, the next new big sort online mobile game. Maybe they have some other projects going on the way. Maybe they'll decide to you know put a hand to like the the new sort online sort online game that came out recently, uh, Black Swordsman Ace. Um, into making like a international release. 
Who knows, right? Yeah, yeah. It's a lot of... A lot of things can happen. So, um... I I'm interested to know. If you play this game, whether it be for fun, whether you're, you're still playing it now, whether you played it in the past, what do you guys think of them shutting down the server? Um... I feel like... To me, I feel like it... It, it was an it's weird move um you know when they first announced it was like a day before they even announced i guess the they're shutting down when they announced that they were gonna finish the ggl story and main story i wondered like where would they go next and they would not go into annexation uh, or world of underworld because that's the whole point of rising steel so um I wondered like what would what would they be next or will, will this be one of those games where like you beat the story but we're still gonna release a bunch of events um it was hard to decide or it was hard to see what they were gonna do and then they just decided to end the game um it's interesting we're not getting nothing though come on we gotta walk out here with the brand new characters because like i said we are gonna be coming back we're gonna be doing the events we're gonna be continue making content on this game until the very last day. We need to honor Memory Deep Fry. So we gotta honor it right now, getting some of these new characters. Argo, give us that good luck right now. Let's see it in this multi right now. Six star. Wait, did it skip? Yep, it did. Ah, Leafa, there we go. There we go. We got Leafa. Wait. There's more than one? Hold on. Hold on. Don't tell me it's double Leafa. Nope. Wait. Is he new? I actually don't know. I haven't summoned a lot in this game, as you guys can know. Uh, no, he's a five star. He wasn't new. But we got the Leafa, so. I can uh, switch back. Yeah, these are the only two banners. I never summoned on weapons in this game. Especially now. Like, um. The game's ending, so might as well just use the rest of these cubes or cubes. I have to get too much uh, rising steel. Rest of these diamonds to get the new uh, Kirito and Asuna here. And there's a skip. Let's roll up. Let's roll up. All right, Argo. We got the sparkle. Let's go. Oh boy. Yeah. It's hard. It's hard. Sorry guys, I, I don't know what to say man. Just you know, thinking about it. Oh like uh this game's ending. Um But usually this were like gacha games, they they only live for like four We take Sugaha. They usually only live up to four four years. Um unless it's like really rare and it's like really popular, it can live longer. Um or if we got a six star guarantee, this has to be them. Has to. Um, so uh, it's interesting to see what's going on, like what's going to happen with Integral Factor 2 because if I remember, it was already reaching, uh, reaching or it is at its like four year anniversary um, time step. So it's going to be interesting to uh, see uh, that game is also going to be going down. Uh, Ugh, that can speak. Okay, so that game's gonna be going downhill in the future, or if it's gonna continue to be at the pace it's at, um, it's gonna be very interesting to see. Um, you know what? Comment down below as well. What do you guys think is gonna happen? Are they gonna be working on the next big SAO project, or are they gonna be focusing more on Integral Factor, Rising Steel, and maybe? As well as Black Sword Minace. I'm just gonna see what you guys think. Um, come on. Alright, we take Philia. Philia all day, man. I right, skip. Let's, let's see this. Um, this is gonna be just a quick video, a uh, summon video here. Wanda. I know this is already pretty old news. There we go. Kirito and Asuna. I know it's only called Kirito, but. Basically, Kirito and Asuna. But there we go. We got both new units. 
um the, like i said there's gonna be uh brand new events or not brand new but they're gonna be keep releasing events until the very last day so of course i'm gonna be coming back recording those events and uh having a good time until the last day um like i said two more months of this game being online and then becomes an offline game so hopefully you guys enjoyed if you did leave a like subscribe and all that good stuff to help out the channel um stay tuned for more memory defrag stuff coming very soon in the meantime there are a lot of stuff i'm recording right now such as rising steel um integral factor video actually is going to be coming out later today so make sure if you're interested in that make sure to check that out my very first time playing it and hopefully it becomes more of a daily or weekly thing so yeah if you guys are interested in that make sure to check that out as well and um what can i say rip memory defrag but we will be playing it until the very last day um but yeah guys that's gonna be it I hope you guys are not so hurt um, about this game ending. Um, it was a fun game, I, I would have to say. Um, but everything ends at some point. Anyways, I hope you guys have a fantastic day. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye, everyone.